Hi guys, EBP Man here with Tavits for me. And today we're going to take a look at one of the most high-tech lamps that we've been able to find on the market. This is the BenQ WIT Eye Care LED lamp. Let's check out what makes this lamp so special. So the BenQ LED lamp is a premium designer desk lamp. Um, it features an 18 watt bulb that is capable of illuminating at 1,800 lux. And it's fully dimmable, has touch controls, and it has various um, color temperature settings that we're going to see in a couple seconds. But the one thing that makes this lamp unique is the fact that this lamp is designed for e-reading. And you heard that right, e-reading. And what makes that different is that most lamps today are designed for reading paper surfaces, surfaces that don't really involve electronics. And more and more, we're seeing um, not just the users of these lamps, like you and me, but our children as well, are now being given devices in schools that feature either iPads, um, Android tablets, or even Chromebooks, um, and also uh, MacBook Airs to do their schoolwork. And the lamps that they have in their rooms are not designed to make the best reading experience. This lamp really redefines the way lighting takes place in a world that is now electronic based. So this is going to be the best lamp for you for uh, online gaming because we have to be realistic we do online game for browsing the internet for working with multiple screens because we're gonna see kind of the output of this lamp because it's a pretty broad output you'll be very impressed with how bright this thing gets and how much of an area it covers and then also for the reading that you may do using any of your electronic devices if you have this at a bedside or in an office setting so let's take a look at what's included with this lamp and we'll check out all the features now once you get your lamp uh, package you're going to get have obviously the lamp and the base and the base is a heavy base and this base uh, comes separately detached but it's very easy just to place it on top of it but the base is very sturdy and it's sound so that you never run into a situation where this lamp as it gets extended it uh, tips over because as you see the armature here in the lamp area that has kind of like a smiley face design you may worry will this ever tip over and because the base is heavy you'll never have to worry about that you will have a power adapter that comes included so you can see that right here and then you have a very heavy duty uh, braided cable so this cable is going to ensure that you don't have any kinks or any damage uh, in addition to that you'll have a user guide that's going to come in explaining everything about the lamp so very simple I would say uh, packaging and implementation where you have your lamp the base the power adapter and a user guide let's now start taking a look at the features um, and the range of this lamp now one other thing I wanted to highlight uh, when it comes to this lamp as as you look at this base that we just talked about now this is an adapter that's available separately if you are considering something like this for a drafting table which I think this also works really well for a drafting table uh, you'll notice that there is a clamp system that is also available so that it eliminates that base so you could actually use this in a drafting table setting or even on a computer desk setting where you want to completely eliminate that base this adapter is available separately but it also gives you extended flexibility when it comes to how you place your lamp so now let's take a look at the overall functionality that we have with the lamp uh, first of all to turn on the lamp uh, you would touch this metal ring here and you notice I just turned it on I'll tap it to turn it off turn it on and I'll turn it off. I'm going to do some lighting examples, so I'll dim um, our lights in our studio. The, you have also controls here. This control here is going to allow you to adjust the brightness. So um, let me leave it on. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the knob. And I can lower it, and you can see the light goes down. And it's tactile, so you're actually getting feedback. As you're turning it around, there is um, you actually feel a like a clicking uh, sensation as you're uh, increasing and decreasing and as I move it it continues to move and really you can continue to move it and it won't do it will basically hit its maximum brightness and you will not be damaging uh, the lamp by moving forward so you don't have to worry about damaging the knob by going too fast or too slow or over brightening because you just won't it will just get to a level and it will stop so as you see here lowering and increasing uh, the actual lamp is done very easily via this knob and then turning this on and turning it off is just about tapping the metal ring. Now the other thing I always get a question about is you know what does the LED panel look like and what does it look like illuminated so what we're going to do is we're going to turn this on it may get a little bit bright in the recording so I'll just caution you on that 
And what we're going to do is just turn it on so you can see what happens and how things light up here. And then we'll go through the brightness settings. I'm going to tap the on by tapping the side. And then you see that brightness coming out. And you see how that fills up this um, LED pane rather nicely. And what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to um, leave it on and then turn the knob to make it brighter. And you can see how the brightness intensity goes up. And then I'm going to reduce it so that you can see how the brightness intensity goes down. So that gives you a view of what's going on in the panel. Now the lamp also has a feature called eye care. And what eye care is going to do is it's going to automatically adjust the brightness of the lamp uh, according to the ambient lighting in the room and what's going on. Think about it this way. Have you ever turned on the lamp and kind of blinded yourself like your eyes take a couple seconds to adjust? Well this lamp is going to help you alleviate that. So you notice I have a bright light source here for a tablet because it is an e-reading lamp and works with monitors and things like that. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on the lamp. And when I turn on the lamp you're going to see that it's a certain um, color temperature and also it's a certain brightness. Now what I want you to notice is right here where my finger is on the upper right hand corner of the screen you'll notice that there's no light here. This light is going to turn green in a second and something's going to happen to the lighting. What I'm going to do is enable that feature. So it's going to take into account the lighting area and what I'm doing and then provide the best optimal reading experience based on that light and my surroundings. You turn on that mode by pressing and holding this ring here for two seconds. So I'm going to do that. And now the light's adjusted and it's changed to make sure that the screen that I'm reading or what I'm doing and the lighting scenario is the best possible for that reading experience and it's going to reduce eye strain tremendously and you can see that that little green LED light is on letting me know that it's optimized the lighting experience. Now the lamp also has multiple uh, I would say um, temperatures or light modes that are also going to enhance the way you read um, or any type of screen or a physical document. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn on the lamp first. You'll notice that I don't have that special mode that's going to be easier on our eyes. I don't have that eye care on. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to press the, the dial down on the uh, light control. And when I press it down, I'm now going to turn, oh, sorry, turned it off. I'm going to turn the dial. And as I turn the dial, let's do that again, the color temperature changes. You'll notice how it's changing, and we'll go back. And that's pretty much giving me a different reading experience based on what I'm doing. So once again, you can use that feature to just change the overall temperature of the light. So this concludes our review of the BenQ WIT Eye Care LED lamp. Again, a very powerful lamp one of the smartest lamps available on the market that's really going to allow you to have the best experience you can when reading digital screens, LED screens, your computer gaming, whatever it is that you're doing that happens to be with electronics or even paper products by having some of those intelligent features that we saw. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions about this product, leave it in the YouTube channel. And as always, don't forget to share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.